Hey everyone, I am here today to do a fun comparison for you. Today I'm going to show you some curly and straight styles, actually two curly and one straight style that I think you could use interchangeably. And so if you're looking for sister styles that will help you have some variety in your wig wardrobe so that it will look like you're just changing up the style of your bio hair, Stay tuned for this one because I've got a treat for you. Today I am going to show you three different wigs. All of them are Ellen Villa wigs. One is Turn. Turn happens to be on my head. One is Girl Mono. And one is Tempo 100 Deluxe. This is going to be super fun. So right now I have Turn on my head. This is Ellen Villa Turn. And Turn is in the color 630, 6.30, which is chocolate mix. And what's interesting is I'm going to show you Tempo 100 Deluxe, which is a straight style. It's also an Ellen Villa style. It's also in the color Chocolate Mix, but the color code is different. The color code of this one is 830.6. 6.30, 830, so 830.6. They're different color codes, and they have slightly different tints to them I would say this one's just a little bit um, gosh not even really maybe this one's just a little bit overall darker in appearance just super slight though it's very slight me kind of I'm trying to think of how I can get them so they're enough side by side it's so slight that I just don't even think it's noticeable unless you're gonna hold them up side by side so it's just beautiful. It's a very pretty brunette with just a little bit of auburn tint to it. And then the girl mono that I have is actually in the color chocolate rooted, which is, and I didn't grab the tag, 6.30.4, I think. So it's got all the same color codes in it. I would say girl mono looks a little bit more highlighted like the auburn runs through it a little bit more, but these are all so similar that I think you could get them all interchangeably, no problem. So let's take a look at these styles. So turn is the shortest of the three styles. Turn is, uh, you know, above chin length, heavily layered, lots and lots of curls. I have always said that turn is a shorter version of girl mono. Quite short in the back. A little bit of a stacked effect just slightly super darling it's just she's comfortable she's short um, very lightweight no if there's permatease it's very little bit of crimpy fibers no poofy pillowy permatease just a little bit of crimpy fibers kind of right up in here she has a mono part and a lace front she is very similar very similar to girl mono uh, but girl mono is in the Hair Power Collection and Turns in the Changes Collection. So they're in different collections, but they're real similar. So I'm going to show you Girl Mono so that you can see the two, and then I'm going to throw on Temple 100 Deluxe, which is the straight style. And I'll explain why I show them both, even though I think one might be more realistic than the other to be wear, worn as sister styles. So here's Turn. Let me put on Girl Mono for you. Girl Mono is longer. Like I said, Turn to me is like a shorter Girl Mono. So if you have turn and you want something longer, I would go with girl mono. If you have girl mono and you want something shorter, then I would go to turn. I mean, seriously, they're just, the curl pattern is similar. It's this curly kind of wild and crazy curl pattern. Not so over the top that it's um, kind of hard to, to feel like it looks realistic. It looks like somebody has nice and curly hair and they just took product and scrunched it. That's what it looks like. I love Girl Mono. Girl Mono is my number one favorite all time style. All time. And Turn for me is a nice change of pace. She's just a little short for my typical taste, but she's still super cute. Both of them have a lace front, great lace front, great, you know, mono part. They're very similar cap construction. I just absolutely love this. And this, uh, this Girl Mono is my backup so it's brand new she's been living in her box for this video I just took her out of the box sprayed her down with water scrunched her up and hung her upside down that's all I've done with her turn has been living in her box for quite some time 
six months, seven months, a long time. I just don't reach for her very often just because she's so short. Uh, and all I did was shake her out and put her on. <laughs> They're such great shake and go styles. All right, so let me uh, put on Tempo 100 Deluxe. I personally think that it's less of a stretch to say Tempo 100 Deluxe and Girl Mono are sister styles because turn is so much shorter. Where I struggle though is that if you were to curl your hair from six straight, it is gonna spring up quite a bit. So I think you could probably get away with either. People just aren't that observant overall. They will notice that you curled your hair or straightened your hair, but they're not going to notice like the length doesn't make sense. You know what I'm saying? They're not looking at your straight and curly style side by side. All right. So this wig, <laughs> I love this piece. She is a fully hand-tied cap, so the biggest difference is the cap construction, well, aside from the straight and curly. This cap is a fully hand-tied cap. It is luxurious and gorgeous. So this is Tempo 100 Deluxe. So I don't know if you can tell why I think this one, uh, Girl Mono, is probably the more realistic curly straight style just because I think turn I mean is so much shorter I also really like the fact that this has these layers and girl mono does have curly layers so when you see these layers it kind of makes sense then when you see the layers in girl mono or vice versa I do honestly think you could do either one though you could you know definitely go with turn and have people just think that it you know, sprung up quite a bit with all the curls. So I'm going to throw Girl Mono on again so that you can kind of see me go from straight to curly. And at the end of this video, I will put pictures together so that you can see them side by side. So you can really see how you really could go from straight to curly and it really wouldn't matter. And the fact that the color codes aren't exactly the same, I really don't think it matters. I think you could go with chocolate rooted and chocolate mix and it would be just fine. I really do. So you can see shorter layers here. So you've got shorter layers there, you've got some shorter layers here. The only thing is that the length of this one is really similar to the length of Tempo 100 Deluxe. And it would spring up a little bit if you were to curl your hair this much. Which is why I'm saying I think you could probably get away with either. Um, some people might find that turn is just a little bit too short for them. And so that's just where I'm, I'm trying to give you a couple of options. All right, so now I'm going to go from the straight to turn. Just so that you can see both of them quick change side by side. Like I said, at the end you will get a picture. I will put a picture up so that you can see it in a picture. And maybe I'll um, even stick a picture on my community page. Uh, for those of you who know, if you go to my main YouTube channel, there's like tabs at the top. You can find my playlist. There's a community page. Maybe I'll stick a picture there too, just so you can see it um, not flashing at the end of a video. All right, so you've got it now. Here's Tempo 100 Deluxe. Try to do a quick change. And then we've got Turn. So she springs up quite a bit. So I would say that neither of these are a hundred percent perfect one from the other. Um, you know, I don't know that your hair would spring up quite this much if you curled it, but maybe. So again, people aren't that observant. They're not going to be seeing these side by side. So I don't know that people would notice. What they'd say is, oh my gosh, your hair looks so cute. Did you curl it? Or if you wear your hair curly most of the time and you want to go straight, wow, your hair looks good straight. You know, they're not going to say anything about, hmm, I don't think you could have curled your hair like that unless you got it cut too. I just don't think that's going to happen. Anyway, so that's just, this is it. This is what I came here to do. Show you guys these 
styles all together so that you have an option if you want to go straight to curly. I think we should all have some variety in our wig wardrobe. It makes it feel a little bit more normal. Like if you were somebody who used to style your hair in the past, you would sometimes take a curling iron to it or put curlers in or whatever it is that you did, then it's really great to find wigs that will allow you to do that with wigs. And I think these ones are really perfect. Keep in mind, Ellen Villa wigs run just a little bit average petite. I will tell you something though, I think turn runs just a little large, not large cap, bigger than average petite. I think turn is really an, a solid average and I actually think Girl Mono is really close to a solid average. The hand tied cap of Tempo 100 Deluxe though does run average petite. It does fit me smaller than both turn and Girl Mono. It still fits me great. Look in the description for my measurements. I also have a review of turn, I'm sorry, Tempo 100 Deluxe all by itself. So I'll link the review in the description as well so you can see my full review of Tempo 100 Deluxe. I also have a review of Turn. I also have a review of Girl Mono. You can find them all. Thanks for watching, you guys. I hope you have a great day, and I'll talk to you soon.